Hello, I'm James Matthews Paul. We're here at Graph Expo uh, for PrintingNews.com and the show's daily videos. Uh, I'm here with Tanya Starr, uh, president of Printer Presence, and um, I just want to go straight in and ask you. Over the last uh, 16 years, obviously, you've been providing an online presence for printers where maybe they haven't had one or maybe where it needs developing or augmenting. Over the last year or so, what do you think uh, the most popular products or solutions you've been offering have been? So the um, great question and welcome. It's nice to have you. Thank you. And thank you for having me today. Uh, the without question is understanding the move to responsive design and the role that that is playing on the trends in mobile and tablet usage uh, for all consumers and business to business consumers and the adoption and need to have the ability to be accessible 24 seven on any device and how printers are trying to evolve to that and, and how does that work with their business model. So that's a big big change this year. They've finally adopted that and um, the need for help and coaching and direction and how to engage with today's consumer. It's, this leads nicely onto the next question because uh, digitization has been something that we've been trying to get printers to, to accept. What do you think the biggest challenges are that printers are facing in the modern day? Yes, I believe it's really embracing this wide array of services that the consumer, the, the business to business consumer needs in today's market. And we're traditionalists, we're craftsmen in this industry, uh, coming from the printing industry, I owned a print shop, and to move to this evolution of, of software and technology and how, how can an email marketing piece possibly coordinate with a direct mail initiative and drive to uh, a web interface and that then tying into um, online ordering. They just are struggling with the skill set and how to tie all of that together. And it is a huge challenge and some have chosen not to take this path. And that's where I believe we see those shops closing today. And for a printer who maybe isn't quite so um, aware of everything that can be done with the other channels in that marketing mix, what advice would you give them about the best way to integrate all of those different offerings mm -hmm. and step into accepting them. Okay, so one, a lot of the print service providers are saying that they're, they've stepped into this, but they're not able to fulfill that in its entirety. And what I would suggest is that they find a partner to help them with that, or, um, and, not or, and hire skill sets that are slightly elevated in looking for individuals who are great at writing content, uh, and staff who really understands search engine optimization, social media, um, and these integrated marketing concepts that we haven't had in our industry in the past to help them really move forward. So it's rounding off the square really, isn't it? And making sure that instead of having this sort of this lumpy bit that you can't quite manage or you're underdoing, that you're really embracing that and making sure that you're getting that skill into your business. Yes, either by hiring it through the, the team members or partnering with a company who's got it figured out. Perfect. Whatever works best for, for the print service provider. But do something, just do something. Just do something. And I suppose there is so much to see and that's why we're here. It's Graph Expo, it's a great big trade show and there is so much that a printer can come and absorb here. Yes. Uh, what do you think that printers should be looking for at this show and what do you want them to take away from it? So the um, putting our services aside because of course I'd love for everyone to come and, and visit with Printer Presence but what I really want for them to look at is um, the breadth of the equipment that's here and, this, and what the output is on that equipment and how that can fit with their target market, where wherever they live in the United States, whatever their primary industries are that they're focusing on, what do they see here that they can fit and bring back to, to those individuals that will help their business grow? And be very open to the software and the evolution and the technology that's here and looking at where that can fit in their organization rather than being resistant to, that's great, but I think I know how to do that better, or that's great, but it's too expensive. Really step back and look at how everything can fit together for their business. And they may not make the decision to buy it here, but when they go back, they know what their options are and they can speak more knowledgeably to their customer base. 
Tanya, I think that's fantastic advice across the board. Thank you so much for joining us at PrintingNews.com at Graph Thank Expo. Thank you for having me. I, I look forward to talking with you more. Oh, likewise. Thank you so much. Perfect. No problem.